Hi everyone. Today I thought we'd get together and do a little art project. Um, I know how much the kids love to paint when we're in the classroom, so I thought it would be a fun thing that we could do today together. Um, what you're going to need to do this project is some paper, some paint, any color um, is fine, something to put your um, paint on, and what I like to use is styrofoam mini plates because it doesn't absorb through and also the way it's shaped, it has a, it's a little well so to keep the paint contained in there um, for your child. And some paper rolls, these are actually just from toilet paper, and a bristle brush if you have one, and some scissors. So what we're gonna do today is actually make little stampers out of the toilet paper roll. And we're gonna um, transfer them to our paper and make a nice little, um, some flowers. So all you need to do is take your scissors and cut through the bottom of the toilet paper roll. And it, it doesn't have to be anything fancy, just make some cut marks on it. And then when you bend them out, it'll make a little stamper pattern um, for the children to use. You can use um, cookie cutters. The kids like doing that. Um, a fork, a plastic fork, anything like that that they can dip in and transfer to the paper as opposed to doing a lot of um, finger painting, which is what we also do. But this gives them a little bit of, um, you know, differential between using your hands and using utensils to, to paint. So all you need to do is once you have your toilet paper roll cut and the little pattern on the bottom, just dip it into the paint and then transfer that onto your paper. And I had a couple already prepared ahead of time. But you can see how the different ones look on your paper. This is just a fun thing that um, the children could enjoy at home with you and keep them occupied and engaged in something fun. And also, we've used a bristle brush in the classroom before as well. And if you dip, just dip that into the paint and transfer it onto paper. Let me get another piece so you can see it. It actually does make a little pattern, and the kids like doing this as well. Hopefully this will give them hours of fun and a different way to paint other than using their hands. So I hope you enjoy this project, and I hope um, I get to see you guys real soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.